For everyone making six figures, what do you do for work? People should be listing their age here as well. Crane operator in the oil industry. Easiest job I've ever had. $3,000 to get your NCCO and $6,500 to get your CDL. I work 12 hours days but only on the crane 1 1.5 hours a shift. The other 10.5 11 hours is spent sleeping, playing Xbox, watching movies, etc. Aircraft mechanic. Staff scientist at a national lab. But don't get too excited. You go to college for nine years first. And lots of analysis shows the better money is taking an undergrad engineering job getting paid sooner, and working up the corporate ladder. I basically get to chase down whatever cool ideas I want though. Within reason. Shoot positrons through magnets to make x-rays? Let's do it. Can we make a better jet engine using redacted for compression blades? Here's 20 million dollars. Go find out. Pharmacist. Public librarian in California I'm at the top of our salary scale for non-managers. Since I've been here current job for 11 years. Gross salary is right around $100,000 full benefits and a pension. And I actually enjoy the work. 2. I own a house painting company. 20-30 hours a week of manual labor a week and about 10 of office paperwork. 2 employees. Software developer. To answer another commenter's question, I usually work 30 40 hours a week. Make reports from databases. Mostly. That and related analysis. Helping users use the software. Help design how well configure software. Test it, etc. I'm a court reporter stenographer in the US. It. My job is basically figure out how to herd cats, by asking the cats how they want to be herded. I work in an industry where I will soon be doing all of my work. And no one will care. They will still be entertained. And at some point you will not know the difference. Stunt performer. Accounting. My brother right off the street. No college, some kind of latex factory. Truck driver. Specifically fuel transport and delivery. Average around 150k a year. But can get into the low 200s if I was willing to do FIFO work. Journeyman lineman. Oklahoma. To everybody who responded with their job. Please help me. Y'all hiring? I'm tired of eating noodles and peanut butter. Work in the trades. Many of my buddies who are electricians, plumbers and HVAC all make six plus figures with zero student loan debt. Not too bad. Spray shotcrete for tunnels underground. High school dropout. $1,050 a day. Work two weeks a month. Life's good. Four-year project. Having been out of work since I started spraying. 11 years now. Kiss people's ass that make seven figures. Physician. 30. But also 230k in debt. Outpatient psych nurse. UPS delivery driver. Excellent benefits, Teamsters Union. Drugs. I clean houses. During my days of dusting and clean rich people's toilets. I pull out my phone and tell people I make six figures. I'm a cloud infrastructure manager but since no one knows what that is I just say I'm a technical project manager. I'm 33 and I've been doing this for about four years. I started making a bit over $60,000 year as a junior project manager and I've had two promotions at this point. Currently work in the financial services sector in a Fortune 500 company. Completely remote. Work 40 hours a week except for the occasional weekend release. I'm a private criminal defense attorney. Luckily I don't have any student loan debt. I went to law school on a full scholarship. Not sure I'd do it again if I could reset.
I'd sure never recommend that anyone go $200,000 or more into debt for law school. Nope nope. Does dollar oo count as six figures? I sell propane and propane accessories. I switched careers and no longer make six figures. However I used to make that about nine years ago. Self-publishing my own romance and erotica books. I am 26, I am a stripper and substitute teacher. I make around 130,000 before taxes a year. Public school teacher but in I live in a very expensive area. Have a master's degree. 10 years of experience. And a ton of continuing education credits. My district also doesn't give health care. My best friend is a senior underwriter for Chase Bank. He makes about $115,000. What's really a slap in the tits is he's a high school dropout. Train conductor. It. I'm seven figures in my currency. But six if converted to USD. I'm a non-techie in the tech industry so basically a fuck ton of meetings. Sometimes I scribble boxes and arrows. Trophy husband. Good for all of you. I was never even close to making six figures. Air traffic control. Sales. Screenwriter. I'm 36. And it took me 10 years to a get good. And B get an agent. For much of that time. I made less than $30,000 year working part-time jobs. Tutoring. And waiting tables. Now my fee per script is in the low to mid six figures. It's a little like the NFL lots of people want to do this job. But very few people actually can. And the development window is very long. I make insulin for diabetics. I have no college. It's basically a glorified factory job that looks similar to how a modern brewery is run. Feel like this question gets asked all the time and I think the better question these days is who's making $250,000 and what are you doing? $100,000 depending where you are is literally the new $50,000 $60,000. I always wonder how people even survive and have a house, two cars, multiple kids and make anything less than $100,000. Shit's so damn expensive. $100,000 doesn't go very far these days. Edit to answer the question. Tech sales. Airline pilot. I work for two years to make six figures. Electronic retail manager $300,000. Worked my way up from stockroom at Old Navy in high school college. Highly recruited by other companies. Never used my degree. Geologist my job rocks. Military. Not the greatest job in the world and I sold myself to something I morally don't agree with but I'm making just over six figures after taxes and live comfortably with good benefits retire in another decade so there's that too age 29 software engineer for an automotive company i used to i was doing sales training for a big company screwed that gig up with alcoholism so i work at a rehab now that i'm sober way less money but overall i am happier Pharmacist 250k student loan. Super stressful job that I hate. Would not recommend. ICU nurse with 4 years experience. Love the hours but it's soul draining and would never pick it again. The highs are high but the lows. Oh so 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 low. I'm a Reddit moderator in our Minecraft. It pays about 175k after tax. Consultant. I tell people how to run shit better.